Hi guys, uh, this video is going to talk about how to disable the Gothenburg editor in WordPress 5 and switch back to the old classic editor. So I know that um, with the new uh, WordPress 5 updates, when you go to edit a post now or you can add a new post, you will see that you now have to deal with the blocks. So here for instance, this is one block and um okay you can remove that you have your title here um you have to click on that add block button and then you have the option to add a paragraph image heading etc now this in itself can be quite robust but it doesn't suit everyone and it doesn't suit me to be honest um not to say that this new editor sucks but to be honest uh the gustenberg editor is definitely nowhere near the classic one in terms of efficiency. So if you want to revert back to the old ways where you had your uh, text and visual icon and you could directly type your text without having to deal with blocks, you can simply find a plugin called Classic Editor. So I have it open here, but in case you might not have it open, let me show you. If you go on the wordpress.org websites, you can click on plugins, you type classic editor, and it's the first result that's going to show up. So um, here you can see 472 stars, it's pretty much a 5 star uh, plugin with 2 million installs. So this shows that uh, many people are trying to switch back to the old classic editor. And you can download it from here. Now, if you download it from here, you're going to have a file, a zip file that you will need to upload to your plugins, um, your plugins directory within your WordPress admin. So here I'm going to simplify things and install the plugin directly from within WordPress so that we don't have to upload anything. So instead of clicking here, upload plugin, which is what you will have to do if you download it from here, what you will do is simply look for a keyword here classic editor it's the same one just to confirm you can click on this and the pop-up window will open and show you that it's exactly the same one so we have the same 472 ratings and stuff like that so install now that's what i'm clicking on this button right here so it's been installed let me dismiss this notice. All right, so the moment you are done installing, you can just go to your plugin section. You click on install here, uh, install plugins, and you will see it here. So you just have to activate this plugin here. So now you have it. If you go to settings, you won't see any specific section for that plugin. That's because there's a different way of uh, making use of it. And you have to go to settings here and go to writing because you want to change the way you publish and uh, edit your articles. So the default editor for all users is what you have to control here. This is the block editor the one that comes with WordPress 5, the one that we probably all hate in a way. And this is the classic editor, like the old one. So you can go here, click on save changes. So the settings have been saved. Now let's check back, add new. I'm gonna add a new post now. And I have my old classic editor. So this video is mainly to show you in quick steps how to revert from the new WordPress 5 Gutenberg editor to the um, the classic editor. So um, if you like this video, please make sure you subscribe. Uh, this channel is very new. As you can see, this is the very first video on this channel. So your support is what is going to keep me going. So make sure uh, you let me know if you like this. If you have any questions, just drop them in the comment section and I will make sure to answer you. Cheers.